Hey guys, uh, Life here from iTech. Today I'm going to show you how you can uh, uh, tweak Windows to sign in using a local account. So it's uh, really frustrating. You might have, uh, when you've started to set up the new computer, uh, you may have already connected it to the internet. And there used to be a button there where you could choose to sign in as a local account, but that's now gone. And there is no way you can uh, uh, bypass this uh, signing in uh, or creating a uh, Microsoft uh, account. So uh, it is, you can work around it, but what you need to do is to disable internet and then hit the back button and it'll refresh and it'll ask you to sign in as a local account. So that's pretty easy. If you have ethernet connection, you can simply just unplug the blue cable and hit the back button and you're good to go. Uh, if you have a laptop or a mobile device you're setting this up on, you can simply put it into flight mode or disable the Wi-Fi and refresh and you're good to go. But now I've got an all-in-one PC that is not, uh, there's not an obvious way of disabling the Wi-Fi. So I'm going to show you a little trick on how you can do that using the command prompt. So first we're going to press Shift F10. That'll give you the command prompt. And now we're going to use a command to disable the uh, Wi-Fi interface. So the first thing I'm going to do is uh, I need to know the name of the Wi-Fi interface. So we can find that by typing in netsh space interface space show space interface again and hit enter and now i can see that i've got two interfaces enabled uh, network interfaces i've got an ethernet and wi-fi and the wi-fi name is just simply wi-fi so now when i know that i'm going to go net sh space interface space set oops set interface and then we're going to put in the name in double quotes which is wi-fi in my case and then we're going to hit space disable and hit enter and that's going to take a few seconds now it's ready to go so i can cross out of there and have a look now when I hit the back button and this screen is refreshing and now it's asking me uh, who's going to use this PC it's ready to create a local account because I'm not connected to the internet and this is how you uh, get around uh, the Microsoft account